Celtic. An indifferent start to the season for Motherwell saw them in the unusual position of being unbeaten in the league but still looking for their first win. At Fir Park, they took on a Kilmarnock side in the doldrums without a point and up for sale. Kilmarnock, determined to get their first league points of the campaign, came closest to scoring in the early exchanges. Paul Wright denied by that fine save by Scott Howey. The little striker Wright was proving quite a handful for the Motherwell defenders in the early stages, and perhaps he should have done better there. But it was Motherwell who opened the scoring, and it was bad defensive play again, which was to cost Kilmarnock dearly. As they've done so often this season, they failed to clear their lines. Paul Lambert doing ever so well. He sees Tommy Coyne, and he slips it past the goalkeeper. 1-0, Motherwell. Six minutes into the second half, and Motherwell effectively sealed the tie. Coyne setting up Dougie Arnott. The low cross found Eddie May. Easy for Motherwell. And the home side added to their misery shortly afterwards. From the corner kick, a crazy penalty given away. Neil Whitworth handles. Spot kick. Inexplicably, the defender handles the ball as it comes in from Rob McKinnon. He clearly pams it. No other decision but a penalty kick. And who else but Tommy Coyne stepped up. Quick shimmy. And it's 3-0 to Motherwell. Killy tried to get back into the match, but really it was a lost cause. But you can't fault Tom Brown for effort. Good work in the midfield. Getting the return ball, but no problem there for Scott Harry. Then in the final minute of play, some more action. But sadly for Kilmarnock, no consolation goal. It was a well-worked move though, starting with Lekovic, seeing a space down the left. Gary Holt going on the overlap. Tom Brown is always getting into good position. He gets in the header, but just over the bar, touching the crossbar. No joy for Kilmarnock.